Hey y'all, welcome back to Katie Resin. Um, I got to thinking today, and I have never done a set of coasters on a video before. So today, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use these decals on my coasters. And, I, to, and for this part, I'm only going to pour the, the sides of the coaster and I'm gonna use a moss green mica powder for the edge. So I'm gonna move these over to the side. I'll mix me up some, re uh, mix this in with my resin and I'll be right back. Aren't y'all? I got a moss green mixed up. I did something today. I got these uh, coasters in today. I just ordered them. And I did something that I never ever do. And I measured them. They're a four ounce coaster. I don't think I'm gonna need, I've mixed up four ounces for this part and I don't think I'm gonna need that at all. So I'll pour something else with it. All right. Try to get that backed off. Oops, I just dropped my whole tip off. Broke my whole tip off of that thing. Daggummit. Yep, I guess that's garbage, huh? Let me see if I can find another one. I should have put some alcohol in there too, but I didn't. I still got on the shirt that I wore to work and there's a hair in there. I cut hair and I left the evidence in there. Let me push my sleeves up. Sorry, y'all, I kind of concentrate instead of talking when I pour that edge there. Really, when I pour anything, I don't talk too much, do I?
Flip. Drop my little tool. Something went wrong. Please try again. My phone's acting crazy. That probably show will show up in the video. I think that would be a whole lot easier to put that in a pastry bag and put that in there. Got it up on that side again. Dag gum it. All right, I think that's good enough. Now I'm going to hunt up something to put the rest of this green in and I'll be right back. All right, y'all. I'm going to move this out of the way for a second. I found this little candle holder here. I'm going to spray it with alcohol real quick first. And hopefully there's enough here to fill it.
Well, I don't know if we'll have enough to fill all this or not, y'all. Looks like it might come close. All right, there we are, y'all. And I'll come back for the next step on the coasters, y'all. All right, hey, y'all. Um, We are ready to put the next layer of resin on. And I'm going to attempt to do like a um, crackle effect in that part of the coaster seen it done but I've never done it so I'm gonna use half of my resin I, I think I want like two ounces of clear in each let me turn this light on it helps a little bit I just kind of want to get the base of it covered with clear There's my timer. I think I might have too much in that one. I'd like it about half. I think that's good. Like I said, though, I've never done this before, so. over there but I'm gonna give it a little push okay that's about half of it and I'm gonna mix it in this go back in there I'm probably out of frame right now push those up a little bit I'm just going to get my little tool here and kind of go around the edges. It's probably too much clear. It's probably ain't going to work, y'all. We'll see, won't we? This one, I believe I got way too much in there. <clears throat> Just going to pull a little bit out. There we go. I 
I'm afraid I got too much of every of it in there, y'all. I don't know how else to scoop it out. I don't think it needs to be that full because I'm going to use a lot of green in there to get it to move and whatnot. All right, I'm going to stop messing with it. It is what it is at this point. See a little bubble right there. Come on out there. Isn't that green pretty? It just screams fall to me. I'm going to mix up my green here. Y'all ever done that? <laughs> I try to stay neat and clean, honest, I do. Here we go. I guess these are deeper than what I thought, hey? Like I said, I don't know if this is going to work or not. But we get what we get. And we won't throw a fit. I might boo it.
<clears throat> I don't know if I'm going to have enough. I mixed up 16 ounces. And that's what all of the coders hold, coasters hold. This is my first set of coasters that I've ever done a video on. I've done like one coaster before, but never a whole set. I don't know how smart it was to do a technique that I've never done before. Four's a lot to mess up. If it don't go the way you want it to. I have a feeling I might be putting too much green. I don't know. I've seen this done before, but I've not never done it. Y'all, I should have probably mastered the technique before I jumped into a, four, a whole set of coasters because it's a lot of resin to waste. So, I don't know. I should have probably spaced the green out a little bit more. I don't know. I guess we'll see what we get. And everything pulls to the middle, I believe. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie. It makes me nervous just mixing up enough resin. That's the first time I've ever measured a new mold and pour and mixed up just the right amount of, ner of uh, resin. And I tell you, it makes me nervous that I ain't gonna have enough. But I think we did all right. I've got them domed pretty good. Some of them are domed a little bit more than others, but it is what it is. I'm gonna get these scraped out as best as I can. No sense leaving it in the cup, wasting it, right? There's a little boogie there. Spray them with a little bit of alcohol, a lot of alcohol. I just love that color. It's a real good fall green, ain't it, y'all? All right, y'all. I don't know if we're going to get what I'm going for or not. But we will soon see. I'm going to turn the heat mat on. These are very strong, sturdy molds, too. I got these off of Amazon. All right, y'all, we'll be back after these cure up and we will put on the pet tape and cover them up. I might use UV resin today. Might put a little bit of sparkle on that top coat and just use regular resin. We'll see. All right, y'all. I'll be back when these are ready to unmold. All right, y'all. We're ready to demold. I don't know what we got here, but we shall see. I love these molds. They're very sturdy, very good quality. And as I said before, I got them off of Amazon. Very easy to unmold. I 
All right. My fingers are crossed. My toes are crossed. My shoelaces are crossed. <gasps> it did it! Ah! Ah! It did exactly what I wanted it to do. Yes! Hot dog. Here comes my dog to see what I'm doing. How cute is that going to be? Oh my goodness. <gasps> This one's going to have to be cut down a bit. A little bit too big. I'm going to try to cut some of the plastic off of it anyway. Here comes my dog to see who I'm hollering at. I am so excited! I think it'd be best if I just cut that little pumpkin off but I'm gonna save him for something else y'all he's a save now how did I get that one on and this one off I don't know how that happened ain't they the exact same thing yes well we want them to match, don't we? We'll save that little pumpkin. Okay, I'm going to try to get this in the mid as much in the middle as I can. Oh, Come on. There's something under there. Oh, it's a piece of resin. How rude of you, resin. gonna get this little guy in the middle these are gonna be so stinking cute Okay, now I'm going to put these directly over top of each other. To do the cuts. Let's 
so that they match. And there we are. All right, I am going to mix up some resin. I do have a little bit of spots in these, y'all, but it ain't nothing I'm going to freak out over. I don't care about the bubbles today. All right, y'all, um, I am going to mix up some resin, and I'll be right back. All right, y'all, I did forget to unmold our little uh, candle holder here. Kind of plain looking, but and we'll get that glued up on there. I'll get some pictures of it with this. <clears throat> All right, I did put some shimmer in there. And I used the Crushed Crystal from Unicorn Art. And I'm gonna do a little bit of alcohol there. And then I'm just going to kind of drizzle it in. Just to kind of give it a good coat. I probably got way too much here. But that means we get some bonuses. Oop, I knocked him over.
I think these are going to turn out right cute. I don't know if it's better to push it or to do it like I did before. Just kind of tilt the tray. I think it's easier. I think this is easier. They say anywhere resin goes, resin stays. Starting to run out of alcohol there. Don't you fall on that.
I thought about resin in that, but I'm just going to glue that. All right, y'all. There we have it. I will come back and get some pictures after this top coat cures up. All right, y'all. These are done. I'll bring them in closer so you can see them. All right, I got lucky this time and everything went like I wanted it to. So, first time for everything, right y'all? Here's the clear little candle holder thingy that I did out of just the glitter. Just got poured, poured twice today. It's its lucky day, I guess. And there we are. I'll get these glued together later. All right, y'all. I appreciate y'all watching. And I'll see y'all next video. <laughs>